two teams were real tight. Oh, fuck. To come to the end and then potentially win this fucking thing after the journey me and Sylvia had means so much to us. And the winning team of Final Reckoning and one million dollars. I can't hardly breathe. I'm about to hyperventilate. My heart is beating through my chest. The intensity of this moment is paralyzing. Hunter and Ashley. Winning the final reckoning is pure bliss. It is something that I have waited my entire life to hear. I am now a challenge champion. I'm so angry and I can't even shake their hands. I can't even say congratulations. We deserve this fucking win. And I don't feel like Natalie and Polly have any sort of remorse that they probably just fucked us out of a million dollars. So congratulations, but now it's the ultimate decision time. One of you scored higher than the other. The one person who's making the ultimate decision, whether they want to split the money with their vendetta or to keep the money all to yourself. And the individual winner of Final Reckoning by 31 seconds is Ashley. So Ashley, it's your decision. You either split the money with Hunter, the one that got you here, that helped you make it all the way, or Keep the entire million dollars all to yourself. Take your time. It's a big decision. That's a lot of money. Life changing. You can hear a pin drop in this cave right now. This is the most intense moment I've ever been a part of in my entire life. So Ashley, it's your decision. You either split the money with Hunter the one that got you here, that helped you make it all the way, or keep the entire million dollars all to yourself. Take your time. It's a big decision. That's a lot of money. Life changing. TJ, all those things you said about all the other partners is true, but this guy's belittled me, put me down, slut shamed oh me, gosh. and also threatened my life and my family's life. I'm keeping the money. Oh my God. Duh. Oh my God. I mean, I would say I feel bad, but I don't because this was nothing compared to what I went through all season. You say walking through hell, I live through hell. Your self-worth is something you can't get back. And when someone belittles you so much. I don't know, I just don't feel like she's that good of a person. So it's hard for me to want to talk to her. My partner's crying because she regrets sleeping with Kyle. <laughs> These guys pick on us because they know that we're strong. They I know, but that's have. the thing with Hunter. I expected him to be better. I'm sick of her popping off at the mouth, thinking she can say everything she wants to at any point in time. I'm over it. I'll walk the fuck off. I decided there's no way he deserves this. You guys, to each and every team here, I want to apologize to all of you personally. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't throw this final. I knew that this was going to happen. I'm sorry that I didn't throw this final. We all know the right thing to do would be to split the money. But come on, guys. Hunter was an asshole to her. And unfortunately, this was her final reckoning. And you got screwed, bud. Hunter, nothing you could have done differently would have changed this. Ashley doesn't even take a goddamn split second and a half. She had this shit planned from the moment she set foot in the final. Ashley has now taken one million dollars, but also the title of biggest asshole in challenge history. Oh my fucking God, you will burn in hell for this. 
and karma will come at you for the rest of your entire life. I hope you know that God's got a special You've plan for you. You've already threatened my life, and you threatened my family's life. What you're making is the craziest accusation. Now, that, that slut costs me a million dollars. I'm coming for her family. Is not all what was said? Is I never said? said slut. I would have never done that to you. Kyle, I'm good. Is this stupid fucking slut? Now it's more is for a million dollars. I'm coming for a family. You fucking played me, you stupid fucking bitch. You fucking played me. That's what you talked about. You played me the entire season. You played me. Actually, you're the craziest person here. No one can deal with you. I stood beside you the whole time. You did not do this alone. I was alone. You did not do this alone. And you will burn in hell. Holy shit. I thought I was a savage. But Ashley, you, sweetheart, are the queen of savagery. So I got to tip my hat to her because she did it. And a lot of people may not agree with that, but I'm not one of those people. Hunter. Fuck this, I'm out, dude. Where the fuck's my tennis shoes? Where's my fucking tennis shoes? Somebody get my fucking tennis shoes. Now, I swear to God, I'm about to fucking flip everything up in this bitch. How fucking could you? How fucking could you? I would never have done that to you. You piece of fucking shit. I'll, I'll pray for you. That's what I'm gonna do. I'll pray for you. money. She played me this whole entire game. I hope she feels good about everything. I really do. I will never forgive her for what she done, for how she played me. Not for one second. I just want a freaking million dollars, y'all. Holy hell. But if you've ever been slut shamed, put down, threatened, you don't have to deal with that. You can pack up your shit and you can take your money and you can go. Like you literally don't have to put up with it and you don't have to apologize for getting what you deserve. And I'm not going to. It's been a hell of a season and you just changed my life.